Um, I think it's made me better at, at what I do because it, they're just, it, it instilled so much more passion than anything else I've done. A Portland man lost his dad to drug addiction. Now he works every single day to help others who struggle. Recently, his service was recognized with a big donation. KGW's Lindsay Nadrich met up with him today and found out that there really is a huge need for addiction services here in Portland. Addiction doesn't discriminate. It happens to people from all walks of life. We've treated people that make a ton of money, that have double masters, it doesn't matter. All it takes is a knee injury, a back injury, and, and you could be hooked on an opiate. Ryan Galley sees it every day. He works with people going through addiction treatment at Central City Concern. But this hasn't always been his path. I was making good money. I had good benefits, but you know, dropping off people's Amazon packages wasn't doing it for me anymore. And I didn't want to like, I didn't want to retire at 60 and look back and say, man, I delivered like 2 million packages. That's just like, it wasn't going to do it for me. Ryan's career change came after watching his father struggle with addiction. My dad battled addiction before um, my sister and I were born and he quit. Um, cold turkey, just stopped drinking for like, I think it was like 12 years. But the drinking started again and a back injury got him hooked on something else. The back injury led to um, oxycodone pills, which led to eventually heroin because, you know, when, when you have a back injury, doctors will prescribe you opiates and then they're going to stop prescribing you. And so you're kind of left like, I'm still in pain and now I'm in withdrawal, what do I do? And it's, it's a really common, it's a common theme for a lot of people. In 2017, Ryan's father overdosed. His death came shortly after Ryan started helping others. <sighs> So it, it was kind of like reaffirming, I guess, for where I was at in my life, that I was in the right spot. And Ryan just got another sign. He's where he's supposed to be. Earlier this year, he got an email from Ally Bank asking, how do you give back to your community? He responded, not thinking much of it. And he kind of forgot about it until last month when Ally arranged this meeting with him where they donated $35,000 to Central City Concern in his father's name. The money will help 10 people get treatment. Choosing me was just so humbling. And uh, <sighs> giving me more fuel to keep going. I'm Lindsay Nadrich, KGW News.